All right, so now we have created our very first logo, which is a pictorial logo type for a brand named Food Panda. Now let's discover some other logo type. The second type of logos that we are going to see is minimal line marks. These kind of logos have been very popular for a while now. You can either create images of things or geometric shapes and line designs, and they can be also used to create very, very simplistic logos for your very brand. All right, now let's suppose we want to create a line style of logo for a brand of diamond, which is named as Surat Diamond. So let's see how we can create it. We are going to write imagine and we are going to write geometric minimal logo of diamond. Then we will put a comma and we will give line simple. And let's hit the enter key and see what it is going to generate for us. Till it is producing the result, let us make the sentence more properly and let us try putting the name of our brand which is Surat Diamond. Alright, so here we will write a geometric line logo for a brand named Surat Diamonds. So if you don't know what is Surat, it is a place in India which is very popular for its diamond market. Okay, so here we have written a geometric line logo for a brand named Surat Diamond and Let's hit the enter key and see what is the results for this thing until let's take a look at our very first prompt. So here we can see it creates these kind of geometric line shapes of a diamond that we can easily further develop. We can take them to our editing software like Photoshop, Illustrator or even Canva. And then we can just add any text to them and directly use them as our logos. So if we see on all of these designs, I like the most, which is the third one. First one is good, but it is just a simple diamond kind of shape with white background to it. But this one has a 3D feel to it. So this is good. Now let's see other logo designs. So this time you can see it created some diamond kind of thing and we have diamond kind of shapes, but it forgets our main thing, which is a line logo and it generates some other kind of logo with text on it. So we have to specify further that we want a line logo and we have to specify it by putting up the comma so that we can have the both things, which is our line kind of design and a text so that we can replace the text. So we we'll write imagine then a geometric minimal logo for a brand name Surat Diamonds and then we will also specify the parameter which is no realistic. Alright, so this is a final prompt which is a geometric minimal logo for a brand name Surat Diamonds and then we have specified the no parameter and we have specified that we don't want any realistic photo details as just like these one. So hit the enter key and see what is right in front of us and until it is progressing Let's try out one more prompt, which is minimal line logo of a rose and vector. And let's hit the enter key and see uh, what kind of things it is going to create for us. Okay, so if we take a look at all of these logos, we can say that it is quite as per our theme and as per the one that we desired for. We want a diamond shape of a logo of a brand named Surat Diamonds. And this time we got some really amazing logo designs the first one and the third one is not at good but the second one and the fourth one we can develop them easily further and we can just replace the text and our logo will be ready so this is how easy it is to create minimal line mark logo by using the mid journey similarly let's take a look at what it created here here if we see all of these designs are really good but these are not as per our thing which is minimal line marks but this one, which is the third image is really good. If we can further create the variations of it in the white background, then I am very sure that we can create a logo or a minimal line mark logo out of it. So let's also try to do it. Instead of upscaling, click V3 and here we will write comma white background. Okay, then click submit. And until this thing, we want to upscale this one, which is the second one. All right, so just click U2. And in our next video, we are going to see specifically that how we can work on all this text and remove the background and convert all of these logos 
to real vector logo so that we can use it anywhere as our brand okay so here if we see our logo is properly upscaled and we can do a detailed upscale or a beta upscale on it to make its quality really high but here a question rises that if we don't want these text then why we have created it it depends on us because these fonts are really matching to the logo design so we are going to use the same type of font and then we are going to place this text with the same font and the same kind of color theme so it is very good to create some text along with your logos so that you can replace it and you don't have to do experimentation with the fonts and waste your time on that and in the next video we are going to see actually how we can make it or convert it into a png logo with a complete transparent background and then we will also convert it into a vector art so that's all for this video i hope you enjoyed it thank you so much for watching and goodbye